Meta releases Segment Anything 2.1 model, Spirit LM speech to speech model, and many other models. Microsoft open sourced the most influential paper of 2024, that is, one bit large language model, which means we are able to run a large model such as 100 billion parameter model just in a single CPU. That is super powerful. The amount of energy getting saved just because of this one breakthrough in research. We have a ministerial model from Mistral, ability to run thousands of models from Hugging Face using Olama, another high ranking e lightning model, granite model from IBM, notebook LM's new features, real time voice AI, Anthropic's new financial data analyst, and much more to cover. That's exactly what we're going to see today. Let's get started. So first we are going to see about the different models released by Meta. So the key models which I want to cover are segment anything 2.1. That is segmentation model. So we are able to segment anything from a video as you can see here. And you can see the tracking available. Also you are able to track all these bolts. You are able to track by selecting those elements in an image or video. And this is more of one of the advanced model. So when you compare to the previous segment anything model, this is performing far better, as you can see here. Next is Meta Spirit LM. This is a speech to speech model, which means it includes text and audio. It's a multimodal model. You are able to prompt via speech or text to generate consistent results in both forms. Then we have Layer Skip, enhancing large language model performance with accelerated generation time. This is also released by Meta and it increases its performance. Then we have Salsa, Metalingua, Meta Open Materials, Mexma, Self Taught Evaluator. So these are the updates. If you want me to cover in detail, let me know in the comments below. Microsoft just opens up the code for one of the most influential paper of 2024, one bit LMS, 100 billion parameter model in a CPU with five to seven tokens per second. And the code is available for free to use in GitHub. And here is a clear comparison. So BitNet is the dark blue, Llama CPP is the light blue. And the tokens per second you can see, BitNet is faster than Llama CPP. And the energy consumption is low in BitNet compared to Llama CPP. If you want a tutorial in regards to how to run this locally on your computer, do let me know in the comments below. Next we have Ministral model from Ministral AI. When you see the performance, this ministerial model beats Gemma 2 2 billion parameter model and Llama 3 to 3 billion parameter model on most of its benchmarks. And this is a small model, which means we are able to run this on our mobile device. Even when you see the accuracy score, ministerial 3B and ministerial 8B performing much better than its competitors. Next, there are 45,000 GGUF format models. So if you go to Hugging Face and click models, filter by GGUF, there are more than 40,000 models. So all these 40,000 models, now you can use Olama to run it. Just run Olama run hf.co slash the full path of the model, that's it. And you are able to run this on your computer. Next, eLightning. This is top performing, about GPT-4.0. That is super exciting. And you are able to run this model via API. Next, IBM introduces Granite 3.0 high performing AI models built for business, which means this is completely free even for business purpose, Apache 2.0 license. That is the key difference between Llama and Granite. Llama has a restriction over a limit, but Granite 3.0 doesn't have any restriction. Even when you see the chart, Granite is comparatively cheaper than its competitors, such as Llama 370B, Llama 3.1405B, GPT-4.0 and in regards to safety, Granite 3.0 is much safer compared to its competitors Mistral 7B Instruct and Llama 3.18B. Next we have Notebook LM, customizing your audio overviews and introducing Notebook LM business. So in this, you are able to customize the way the audio gets generated. I've already covered in detail how to use Notebook LM and I'll put that link in the description below. So this is one of the best features I've seen if you are a podcast person. So you are able to upload any data, any PDFs, any research articles and ask it to summarize and generate a podcast for us. And it's automatically able to generate this. Next, in regards to real-time voice AI, 
we have Ikigo, Llama 3.1. This is a fine-tuned version and this is a speech-to-speech -speech model which means you are able to ask questions in your natural language and it's able to respond in natural language. All the code is available as open source so you are able to modify and make improvements if you want to. They used open data sets, they cleaned those data sets, then they passed those data sets to Llama 3.1 8B instruct and instruction fine tune the model. They also fine tune this model for inaudible inputs and multi turn conversation. In the same topic as real time voice AI, we also have Play 3.0 Mini. You can generate speech from text, also, you have real time conversation that is real time API. Even DeepGram introduced unified voice agent api that is a real-time voice api same like openai real-time and we have more competitors now next we have ovis this is a novel multimodal large language model architecture designed to structurally align visual and textual embeddings and it is open sourced now so here's an example find the area of the shaded region i'm going to select that and then send so i'm just passing a text and the image so based on that, it's going to generate me the response because it's capable of handling both image and text all together with a different kind of architecture compared to other models. And you can see the response is getting generated. Measure the approximate area and give us the output. And finally, we have Anthropic Financial Data Analyst. You are able to upload any document that is document with data and it's able to plot graph in real time. That is super exciting. And that's all for this week. Considering you already liked AI news, there are still loads of AI news which I have already covered, which I recommend for you to watch, which I will put that here. So do click the link and I will see you there.